welcome back um, in this video I'm going to show you the route of the products okay so we have already finished our user route and a middleware authentication and in this user route we have like getting the profile data with the with the with the token and update the profile data uh, using the token as well with the put method so right now I'm going to show you the product route okay PLDUCD.TS so we create another find under the under the route I'm sorry so I need to uh, turn on my notification so um so here uh, under the route we have created products.js and yeah so let's do it um, I will say for the products, uh, we have we will use the express as well, e x p r e s s express because we need to use express route, i g u i u require, and express. So we have import express. After that, we can say uh, products r o u t e route equal uh, express dot router. Okay, this router. So uh, we have our router. So after that, we will get all the products from our uh, database. Where is our database? And browse collection. Under the collection, we have product list. Okay, we will get all these products from our uh, product routes. So I will say product route dot get with the get method and then select. So that's it. And after slash, uh, we will use the is essence um, error handler. So we will import that package const async handler equal require ax express essence handler. Okay. So we will use this, and we will import here. And inside this one, uh, we will say async essence and another bracket request and IQ outside of this bracket we will see um, Kali bracket arrow function key so uh, inside this uh, we will create uh, we will get okay we will get all the product const so getting the all the products we don't need the key because we will show these all the products at the home page without the user is login or not okay so uh, I will I will show you uh, like this. So in our um, so yeah. So as you see, so in here, um, so as you see, uh, in here, so we have like home page. If the user is not login or um no auth user or guest user can access these kinds of products that's why we don't need a uh, key for this okay that's why i don't used i don't use any other um any other i mean i don't use the the auth middleware auth okay we don't need the products so we will directly fetch the other products so uh, that's why i will say const bldcds equal a wait a wait uh, I will find from product model so we have model here uh, we have product model so from the product model I will get all these data their name is products okay that's why we need to uh, import this products so in here const build ucd product equal require um, from dot uh, slash model slash products okay so uh, we have imported our product model. So I will say find. I will get all. That's why I don't need to import any other um, parameter here. So I just need to do like this, and we will get our uh, product. So re uh, response will send JSON format with the products. So our product is now sent back as a response JSON data. So let me go and check in our in our um, postman so I will delete all um, okay where's that user login save and user register save change 
we're going to say change uh, save change okay so for this um, user profile so I will duplicate duplicate and then I will say um, or P R O D D U C D or products with the get method user uh, ABI select P R O D U C D S but right now if we call uh, it will get error because we haven't set up in our index.js file for this route okay we'll go and set up so let me open index.js our our main server file and also we need to run our server okay so I will run mbn run server so it will run our server in a port 3000 so like this we need to create another route and this is the PLDUCD as products, ABI select PLDUCD as products, but we need to import our products. Don't forget to export module your product module. Okay, so after that, we can uh, we can use this module later. So, module.exports equal uh, products route. So, our product route module is ready to um, use in our index.js file. So I will go and import anywhere, anywhere you prefer. Okay, so I will create here const uh, PLDCD product route equal I Q I I require uh, dot slash route slash products. Um, I will use the the, the record uh, the same uh, like this because I don't want to use single or double. So everything will be the same structure okay cool so after that um, this comment is very messy here okay so products after that I can use product route PLDUCD product routes so cool so this product route has been module has been imported in our index.js file and we have um, our product route as well so when we call this uh, main route we will get all the products and other product route because we have that best lab here okay so I will fetch as you see we have got our products array list here so let me show you uh, one and two so these products has been uh, returned back as a response JSON data here okay cool so now I, I, I will try to fetch single products so for this one I need to create another route uh, PRO the UCD product route dot get as well so in this here I will fetch uh, the product by the ID so like um, do dot after that ID so it means uh, we, will, we will send the, 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 the dynamic ID anything okay ID will be accept select ID product ID after that we will use the ASN handler as well and there is a uh, handler bracket we will see essence so inside the essence i mean after essence we will have another bracket and requests and respond so after that we we'll use arrow function key the same thing and we we'll say const product product this time one product that's why we don't need s so here list of product that's when we add s okay so we will say await and then product dot find by id okay so we will find with the request uh params.id okay we will bring the id from parameter url okay after that we will get our product so we will have if condition if this product is exist by the id we will do um, the text as we will do another another response so this response will be full full not found let's start with the full full error product not found okay so if it will be found we will return json uh, respond so IES dot uh, JSON this products okay this product will be sent back so I will format so everything is fine so we'll go back and after that we need to pass the product ID okay here like product ID and then if I send one product has been found like this so here as I show you um, I will show you yeah uh, yeah if it um, if it is user click on uh, one product uh, here as you see if it is user click like single product okay so we got 
uh, product with the product ID as you see here the, the, the URL look at who's product slash and the, the ID of the products so single product page like this so we we will um, uh, we will use this API later on with the React um, UI user user interface like this okay so cool uh, yeah that's it after uh, we have set up um, product routes we will set up another one called order so user can uh, make an order and inside the order model so that's it um, the ABI will be finished after we have set up order route so we will go to our React project after we have finished our ABI thank you guys see you in the next video